received the ball, he went for a dribble with a lot of confidence. He used body fence pretty well, but he couldn't go past the 2v1 situation. Another interesting point about him is that he asks for passes a lot. Also, he keeps on moving without the ball to be always in a position where his teammates can easily pass the ball to him. If you see this again, you will notice that he quickly checked his shoulder to know the opposition's position. So he took the decision to play the one touch pass as he was under pressure. Finally, his good positioning and off the ball movement pays off as he intercepts the ball in this position and moves forward. Something that always helps you in football generally is taking quick decisions. Harvey here did not think twice. He had a look on the goal and decided to shoot. Again, always moving to be available for a pass. Another thing that Elliot does so good is his first touch dribbles. His first touches are very good generally, but he's so talented when it comes to these kind of dribbles. Klopp played him in all forward positions in this match. You can see now that he switched positions with Origi. Here also he tried to play a 1-2 pass with Henderson, but the link was not made. One touch passes can be counted as a strength to Harvey. As I said, all his first touches in general are very good. He did a really good job on the left side in this counter attack. And at the end, he tried to play a one-touch volley pass to Origi, but he failed to do so. Then, Club switched his position with Chamberlain, and he played on the left side. Here's what I said at the beginning of the video. He takes his full time on the ball, and does not rush the passes, which allows him to make good decisions. Here is something that is very important. Notice how his teammates help him to get more confident by giving him a lot of time on the ball and playing these easy passes to him. Now that he got more confidence, he decided to dribble and try to score once he found himself in this dangerous position. As you just saw here, he did this amazing first touch dribble, but he got fouled. He is a great talent and he has the potential to become one of the best. At the end, I'll be uploading a full analysis about Tottenham's new signing, Tanga Ndumbele soon. So stay tuned. Thanks for watching.